chapter 9, question 74. Uh, now, on this one, I'm going to ask you to take a look at example 33 in the textbook because, again, it does detail out uh, what is going on here. We've got a lottery game uh, where they're picking six numbers from the numbers 1 through 48. So there's 48 different numbers. Uh, but now this time we're looking just to match five out of the six uh, because we would win second prize. And so the, we want to find the probability of winning the second prize, not the grand prize. Uh, so the way we're going to do that is we're going to count all the ways that we could match five out of six, and then we'll divide by the total ways that the six numbers could be chosen. Uh, as with most lotteries, the order the balls are drawn out, the order the numbered balls are drawn out is not important. So it's a combination. So what we've got as far as the, the total possible ways uh, to draw the six numbers out of the 48 is 48 NCR6. We'll choose those six numbers. That's how the, the game plays. So that's, that's what our probability is out. That's the total number of ways to choose the six uh, numbers. What we want to happen is of those, uh, uh, we want to match exactly five. So of these six that came out, of the six winning numbers in CR, we want to match five of them. Six match, we got to match five of those six and not match the leftover, sorry, it should be 48, right? Not match the leftover, so six from 48 is 42. So there's 48 ba 42 balls that didn't come out that are not here. So out of these 42 in CR, we want one. Okay, so we want one ball not to match, five balls to match. So when we multiply this, we divide by that. What we get is, you'll see when you do the calculation, six choosing five, you get six. When you do 42 choosing one, you get 42 ways that can happen. And then this bottom one ends up being 12,271,512. Uh, so then you end up with uh, six times 42 is 252 over 12,271,512. And that's how they left the answer in the back of the book. I know 